another very warm day ahead of us as temperatures get back into those mid 60s. We might even see places pushing closer to about 70 degrees by this afternoon. Definitely going to be seeing that in more of our southern counties with those warmer temperatures. Now are going to be tracking some high wind speeds. Most of that building up pretty early on in the morning. Going to be starting those wind speeds out in the 20s and then later on to the afternoon. Maybe our northern counties seeing some of those approaching about 30 miles per hour. I'm expecting those to back off just a little bit overnight, but again, getting into tomorrow by tomorrow afternoon, seeing these winds yet again into the those 20s and almost 30 mile per hour winds by that point. Now we are going to see those really increase going into Monday evening. It is as this storm system is about to start is about to start entering the area by that point into Tuesday morning. That really going to be bringing a lot of rain for the morning and afternoon on Tuesday and could even see another lingering system behind that that brings rain all the way into Thursday. Won't be seeing really continuous rain for this, but definitely going to be looking at some of these showers to start off really pretty late in onto Monday. We will see those clouds though returning pretty early ahead of it by the afternoon on Monday. Going to see a lot of us getting these lighter clouds and then later on into the evening. That's where we're going to start seeing some of that rain pushing into the area off from the west. Now the system is very slow moving. It's going to start out very, very light and then by the time we get into the evening, that's where we'll start to see some more of that widespread rainfall. Still staying pretty light. A lot of that heavier, the, those heavier bands look to stay off to the west for the start. But by the time we get into Tuesday morning, could see some of that coming up from the south and bringing a lot more of that heavier rainfall for Tuesday morning. Definitely want to be monitoring that for that morning commute and even for a lot of the day on Tuesday as by Tuesday afternoon, still holding on to a lot of these showers. I am going to be anticipating us still seeing some of that like I said, into Wednesday as well. Another system looks possibly to bring some lighter showers heading into Thursday, but still through all of these showers, not going to be losing too much warmth. And even once all of this clears out, it looks like by next weekend, we'll see some sunshine finally returning to the area and temperatures climbing back into the 60s.